everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to size the Lori Whitlock box cards. The easiest thing to do, I'm just going to move it out of the way for a second. I'm going to insert a shape. I'm going to choose the square. So I want my envelope to be five and three quarters by four and a half inches. So I'm going to unlock my side, my shape here. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to click the edit panel and I'm going to type in the size I want. So my width is five and 5.75 and my height is 4.5. Then when I press enter, my rectangle is exactly the size I need. I'm going to bring this shape back over here and now I can line up this envelope until it fits my square. After moving this, the rectangle over the envelope, I'm going to drag out the shape I'm going to drag out the image of my card, the pieces for the card, until this fits properly. Shape. There we go. So it's a little bit longer than it needs to be, but it will fit my card. And now everything is sized proportionally, so everything will work the way I need it. Then I don't need this rectangle anymore, I can delete it. So you can see that for this particular shape, it ends up being 22.25 inches in width and 11.48 inches in height. But don't worry about that because of course it's not all going to be put on one large mat. Design Space will organize it for you so that the mats are set up and everything will fit on 12 by 12 mats. So I hope this has been helpful to you. Thanks so much for watching.